Hi, I am Ganapati Bhatt from Informatica Global Customer Support. In this video, we will see how to import a Snowflake source definition using a custom SQL query in Power Center Designer. Agenda of this video is prerequisites required for this connector and steps to import a Snowflake source definition using a custom SQL query with a demo. Regarding the prerequisites, Snowflake connector is a license based connector. So you need to have the power exchange for Snowflake connector license in your base license. Also, Snowflake connector plugin must be registered with the Power Center repository service. You can verify the Snowflake connector license from admin console. Click on the license options tab. Under the connections tab, you will see the power exchange for Snowflake license if your license is entitled. Also, you can verify the plugin from the repository service click, click on the repository service and plugins under this plugins section snowflake plugins registered snowflake plugin will be visible let's quickly jump on to the demo from the designer client i have connected to the repository we need to click on sources create power exchange for snowflake source and provide the snowflake credentials once it's connected to the snowflake in the import window you will see two options one is import from object another one is import from custom query you need to select import from custom query option when you click on this query win custom query option this query window appears you need to provide your custom SQL query here. I have provided a sample uh, uh, SQL query with a simple join condition. Also, you can name uh, the query object. I just name it as query one and we need to validate the SQL query. Query is valid and click on import. Now the snowflake object is imported in the designer with all the mentioned ports in the custom SQL query. If, if you want to edit the custom SQL query, you can edit it by clicking on the source and then go to custom query, edit or view custom query option. In this tab, you can alter the SQL query or validate it. I will create a simple mapping with this imported object and a workflow mappings create I'll just name it as M underscore snowflake test one click OK sources take the snowflake object and I'm I just create a flat file target I will generate a workflow. Workflow generated successfully. In the workflow manager, edit the session. Under the mappings tab, select the source and we need to give the same SQL override in this SQL override option. The custom SQL query which we use to import the object, we need to provide it here. Click OK. Let's run the workflow. The workflow is now running. Workflow got succeeded. For more details about our Power Exchange for Snowflake connector, please refer the user guide from our documentation portal docs.informatica. We would like to hear a feedback from you. Please drop us an email at supportvideos at informatica.com. Also, you can send us your queries in our Twitter account, InfaSupport. Thank you.